Welcome to Birthday to Tarot and this reading is from 8th of January to 14th of January. So let's check what are the messages for you. The Hermit. of grace queen of scepters Hanged man. And three of graves. So here we have three of graves. Looks like Libra that you are in a third party situation probably. This person is uh, flirting around. Maybe they are um, seeing someone and uh, they say that it's a friendship and they feel like that is more than friendship. When I say a third party, it could be anyone who's being an obstacle or um, your person is making them a priority over you. So this could be a family member, this could be a friend or this could be an obstacle. But no matter what, you might be feeling ignored or you might be feeling like they are treating you. Um, like an option and uh, this could be really you know frustrating here but again looks like whenever you choose to walk away this person is back with excuses they want to make sure that uh, they won't repeat it again they won't do it they won't do the same things again and uh, you know somehow this is uh, going to trouble you again I mean looks like with the card of the hermit this person is on a journey maybe they walked away or you walked away there is separation between both of you and uh, you might be feeling like uh, that uh, this person is okay with it they actually don't care whether you are around or not they are not bothered and for them other things are their priority but uh, Libra the hermit is about taking a journey inside themselves this person is not someone who is serious i mean this could be someone who is really emotional who is really charming who um, is simply enchanting but again when it comes to seriousness this person is not um, serious maybe they are not mature enough at least uh, right now but no matter what this journey has already started the hermit is about uh, getting inside oneself so this person is doing the same and uh, this person is, um, you know, facing their subconscious feelings now. Maybe this person wasn't aware what uh, they have inside them themselves. And uh, now they are facing their subconscious feelings. Their subconscious feelings are coming to the surface. And now they know what they exactly need. This person is, uh, you know, maturing up okay and also here we have the card of the hanged man with this card of the hanged man it's telling you to use your brain libra love is all about heart that's right but uh, sometimes our mind uh, tricks us into something so maybe here you need to use your wisdom rather than your emotions and um, your emotions are affecting the way you think right now so in a way you are in control of your emotions here you see this is a snake holding this hangman so even in, sp in even in spite of knowing what is right 
might not be able to do this because somehow these emotions are making you motionless and uh, you don't know how to uh, make a perfect decision or right decision and how to um, handle the situation. So here you have Queen of Scepters. The Queen of Scepters is all about someone who is confident, who is beautiful, who knows what she wants out of her life. And Queen of Scepters um, is someone who will not settle for anything less than what she deserves. So the card is telling you to be yourself, Libra. Maybe you have lost uh, yourself. And um, this hermit is also about you. In a sense that uh, you need to find yourself once again. You are there. This person might have left you with low self-esteem. You might be comparing yourself to someone and you feel like why this person isn't giving me enough attention. Am I not good enough or have I done something wrong? You know, you don't need to think that way because uh, you're all fine. And also here we have Prince of Grails. Prince of Grails is about someone who is um, coming back. So this person will like to offer you this friendship once again, as usual. They are repeating their habits because um, they have realized that they actually can't stay away from you because they know that the kind of attention you're giving them is uh, not comparable to anyone else. So somehow they will again like to draw your attention towards them. But in the end, the tarot is telling you to use your wisdom to make a final decision here. Okay, now this is a general reading. This is not going to resonate for all and the energy could be reversed as well. Also, you can check your moon and vibe and sign. Let's go ahead and check some more messages for you. Eight of sectors. knives Lord of Scepters Wheel of Fortune Harfant. So here we have Lord of Scepters. This person is a pair. This person knows uh, that they are irresistible. They are charming. When they say something, people are mesmerized. It's like uh, this person is perfect at flirting and uh, they might look like um, a creature or sorry, a person out of your dream. And um, you know, this person is not ready to accept the defeat. Here you see this fierce person on this horse. It's like um, they want uh, something to be done as quickly as, po as, po as, quickly as possible. And it uh, looks like that, uh, you know, they're going to uh, do something to get your attention. But again, Ace of Scepters is telling you that you're getting what you are uh, praying for here this person has this wand and you're getting this wand they are offering you what you want but again three of knives is here with the three of knives are you completely healed libra looks like that you are still not healed you are still holding on to something from past and uh, looks like that uh, things are coming back to you but you don't know what to do there is this fear what is waiting for you next what this person will do next and uh, this is obvious because this is not the first time that this person is doing this here we have wheel of fortune wheel of fortune is telling you that uh, whatever you choose the universe is supporting you the heart of is here you are in connection to your spirit 
and uh, uh, this connection with your spirit is uh, helping you manifest the things so it's telling you to focus on yourself first and a little whatever you choose the fortune is going to help you the wheel of fortune is going to give you everything let's check a message for you for longing love is happiness a sparkle inside live deliberately and choose boldly then you have arrived so love is happiness but uh, you have to decide first what you love more this person or yourself and there is a spark inside you which can reignite this fire and uh, live deliberately choose boldly so choose whatever you like do not be afraid of the consequences because whatever you choose wheel of fortune will bring you what you are looking for and what you are meant for so this was the reading for this week i hope you enjoyed it thanks for watching till next video bye